what's going on guys, it's ETA Prime back here again with another LaunchBox tutorial. Today, I want to talk about updating LaunchBox, background updates, and beta releases. So, when you're dealing with beta releases, you have to remember that there will be bugs. These are beta releases. But, if you do opt in on this, you will get features before they're officially released, and I think that's pretty cool. The first thing we're going to be covering is updating LaunchBox and background updates. As you can see here, I'm running LaunchBox 7.15. I purposely installed an older version of LaunchBox so we could get this moving. We're going to click close. So basically, there's two ways to update LaunchBox. You can go to the LaunchBox website, download the release, and manually install it. Or we can have LaunchBox update automatically for us. The second option is the recommended way. So first up, we're gonna start up LaunchBox. I'm on 7.15. We're gonna to go to Tools, Options, Updates, and make sure Check for Updates on Startup is checked. We're gonna click OK. Now next time we start up LaunchBox, it's gonna prompt us if there's a new official release. We're gonna go ahead and close LaunchBox. Wait a few seconds. We'll start it back up. And as you can see, a new official version of LaunchBox has been found. Would you like to update? I'm going to click no because I want to turn background updates on. Now I want LaunchBox to automatically download any new update for me. And then the next time I start up, it should install it automatically. We'll click close. And it's really easy to enable that option. We're going to go back up to tools, options, Updates. I'm going to leave check for updates on startup checked. Then I'm going to check automatically download updates in the background. Click OK. Now in order for this to work correctly, you do need to restart LaunchBox one more time. Now when we start up LaunchBox, we will not be prompted that there's a new update. It's automatically going to download it in the background for us. I'm going to click close. You can go ahead and play a game if you'd like to. I'll just start up a game real quick. Battletoads, Double Dragon. So you can go ahead, play a few games if you'd like to. Import some more games. And in the meantime, LaunchBox is automatically downloading any new update in the background for us. Now, I'm going to close LaunchBox one more time, and we're going to restart it. This time, it should automatically install the new update that it downloaded. As you can see, automatically downloaded it in the background, and it will automatically install when we start LaunchBox. There we have it. Now in LaunchBox 7.16. So I like to leave download and background enabled because I want the newest features of LaunchBox. Now I want to go over updating to beta builds. So like I mentioned, beta builds will have bugs. You might run into some issues here and there. Over on the forum, we do have a specific thread dedicated to beta testing. Now we'll just go to the end here. You can read through here. If you have any troubles, you can also post what's going on. Now we're going to enable beta builds on our LaunchBox setup. To do that, we'll go to Tools, Options, Updates, and we'll check Update to Beta Releases. Beta releases allow you to gain access to new features and fixes soon after they've been developed but you might run into a glitch or two. If you do, please report them using the report issue option under the help menu. Now you can always report there, or like I showed you, you can sign up for the forum and discuss beta testing here. We're gonna click okay. Now since I have background downloads enabled, it's automatically going to download the beta for me in the background. From here, we can wait until the update is finished downloading in the background or we can turn the background updates off. Tools, Options, Updates, automatically download updates in the background. Click OK. 
We're going to close it down, start it back up, and it should prompt us to download the latest beta. A new beta version of LaunchBox has been found. Would you like an update? Yes, but remember background updates do work with betas also. I'm just going to go ahead and install the new beta here. You're now running a beta release of LaunchBox. You will be prompted with the change log here. Big Box has now integrated PDF Reader for viewing manuals with your controller. I showed that off in a previous video. There are some other changes and much more coming. So that's pretty much it for this video, guys. We really appreciate you watching. Hope you have a better understanding of updating LaunchBox in the background. And if you want to join in on the beta releases, you're more than welcome. If you guys could, hit that like button and subscribe. And like always, thanks for watching.